Hey what's up guys, Totally Dubbed here and um, I had a request by Facetta to make a video um, about a week or two ago and I completely forgot it just came to my mind right now uh, the current ROM I'm on is, um, actually I can show you right here I'm on Semaphore JVR 1.6 and I'm on stock JVQ I'm just about to flash over another ROM but um, I thought I'd come over and uh, show you um, the OTA app, the Darky ROM OTA app, which can be found free on the market, which is great. Um, so obviously you've got some easy controls over here, reboot your phone, reboot into Grapri, reboot into download mode. You can flash files um, which are on your SD card. These can be um, uh, kernels, they can be ROMs, uh, boot animations and whatnot. It's almost like flashing via clockwork uh, recovery. You can install and uninstall system apps. As you can see, I haven't got anything which is uninstalled, but I can uninstall some apps. Um, so it just load a little bit. Um, a typical one would be, say, Gmail, for example, if I don't want that. Um, be sure to know what you are uh, uninstalling. Um, but uh, for example, if you do know what you're doing, then that's fine. So FM radio, for example, I can uninstall it like so. And if I want to in install it again I can just go in and install it right there so there you go uh, the, the data is saved on your internal memory uh, internal SD card so don't format that if you've got this installed just in case alright so you can restore user app backup user apps which is useful almost like titanium backup uh, you can change your CSC code which is quite good uh, as you can see I'm on XEU right there um, I just exited the app right there. This will also need super user permissions. I forgot to say that. Um, so obviously, you will need super user permissions. Um, right, you can back up, restore user data, your visual style. You can set up your lock screen, which um, I found sometimes worked, sometimes didn't work. But um, hey, you can give that a try. My advice is when you do try it. I remember about three, four months ago when I was trying it. Um, when I clicked it, it would work after reboot so I'd click it reboot and then it would show my lock screen I don't know how that's changed since then um, you can set your lag fix options as well which is uh, quite useful as you can see I've got my lag fix off uh, and you can set your uh, power menu um, which is quite useful and now we're going to darky rom so this is useful for when you're flashing darky rom roms itself so for example if you're flashing I don't know uh, uh, what what was it back in yeah uh, 10.2 for example 10.2.2 by Darky himself then um, you could for example install modem or not install modem install kernel or not do so when it's green it's going to install it when it's not it's not um, and obviously wipe user data if that's ticked then it's going to wipe user data right OTA this is where it's all at uh, basically OTA is over the air that's what it stands for and it's basically things that uh, Fisetto himself uh, uploads or other, pe other members of Darky Rom, certain members of Darky Rom upload um, so for example in kernels over here we've got uh, Dark Core 4. Point, uh, what's the latest 4.2.1 uh, which is the latest but obviously there's some other ones like 3.5 which are available which is good you can flash kernels, you can flash modems, you can flash boot animations uh, for example boot animations you can usually view them uh, if you scroll that, I mean your internet has to be permitting, that's why I'm on Wi-Fi right now, but as you can see it gives you just a brief preview which is pretty cool. Um, in packages, uh, you've got random packages like the swipe package for example, so that's uh, that's quite useful, swipe JVR, that's quite useful to have. Updates, these are just updates on things which are there, so as you can see uh, JVQ 10 toggle drop down. Um, applications you can install some certain applications like I don't know Darky Tips the GGB launcher which is actually very useful um, super user not very useful but think free office very useful there um, and we can go into visual mods now this will change the look um, of your of your phone and so over here we've got quite a lot of stuff um, and you can go ahead and go through them and see whichever you prefer uh, so as you can see I'm just quickly just looking through them uh, I'm not going to change anything because as I'm on stock JVQ I don't want it to really be changing anything anyway um, so yeah and there's boot sounds as well um, I don't know it's a HDD spin up <laughs> good one
that was a good one. That's that's quite a nice one. That's it's a hard drive um, startup. That's pretty cool. So right over here in the info tab, we can see uh, our model number and whatnot. Um, so what we're on. Uh, in the about section, you'll have some more information uh, over here, um, written over here uh, about the OTA app itself, uh, almost like a web page. And if you want to go to Dark Year on forums, you can straight away go there, uh, like so. Uh, let's see if it loads up or not. Oops, there we go. Oh, there you go, so it loads up. Um, and then we can go keep the project alive. I'm pretty sure that'll be a donation, uh, which I highly suggest, um, If you're, especially if you're using Darky ROM quite a bit. I have donated quite a few times um, back in the day, so um, I would suggest uh, you donate. Uh, it's always good to donate into devs anyway. So um, I hope you've enjoyed this and I hope um, Fisoto has enjoyed this video because basically it's just for him uh, and see if it goes on the market or not. If it does then happy days. Uh, so yeah I hope you enjoyed this video guys and this was an overview uh, video of the Darky ROM uh, OTA app which can be found on the market um, and I will show it to you in the market. I don't know why that noise just came by the way, absolutely no idea. Um, Let's see if the market wants to start up. Do you want to start up? Do you not want to start up? You're going to be laggy. No, okay, you want to accept. That's it. My apps. Um, da, da, da. There you are. Darky OTA. As you can see, it, it's on the market right now. Um, and you can see it right there. Um, and what video is this one? This could be my video, I don't know. Uh, we shall see in just a second. It is indeed. <laughs> so that's my video indeed. Um, so this has probably replaced this video which is currently there because this one's old video as you can see September uh, 7th 2011 and today we are the 19th of December 2011. Right, so I hope you enjoyed that video guys, please do rate, comment, subscribe and make sure you check out the app, even if you're not on a darky ROM to be honest, it is a very useful app, but um, either or, do check it out, if you're on darky ROM you'd be stupid not to get it, so, uh, <laughs> right, take care guys, bye bye.